What's up, what's up, what's up, folks? Sweet Science Sports and McDojo, the sweetest sports channel of them all. And this is your man's, BJ Aloysius. I want to talk about Jamel Charlo. The best thing that ever happened to J Jamel Charlo and his boxing career is when he lost his O to uh, Tony Harrison. And um, that's the best thing that happened to him because a lot of times when people are undefeated, they kind of want to um, protect that O. You know what I'm saying? So sometimes their matches will be set up where they're where they can win the match, where 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 there are more at odds to, to be able to win that match or whatnot. You know what I'm saying? But with that old gone, there's nothing to protect. All right. Um there's nothing else to protect. So now, you know, now Jamel, he can go for the gusto. So if you look at what he did after after he lost to Tony, um he went and uh defeated uh Coda in the third round. I think it's Jorge um, KO in the third round. Then he rematched Tony Harrison and KO Tony Harrison in the 11th round and regained his WBC title. Then right after that, he fought um, Rosario and KO him in the eighth round, eighth, eighth round, and got the um, uh, WBA and the IBF titles. So right now, Jamel Charlo has three titles. He has the WBC, WBA, and the IBF. All right. And he's set to fight Brian Castano in July. All right. To become undisputed or fight for undisputed. So in July, uh, July 17th, something like that. On that day, we will get an undisputed champion at 154, whether it's Charlo or it's Castano. All right. All right. So. That's the best thing that happened to Jamel is that he lost to Tony Harrison. All right. And he had, he has knocked everybody out after that. All right. You talking about, so this way he rematched Harrison, got his belt back, fought Rosario for two belts, got those two belts, got three. Now his very next match is going to be for undisputed. Now that's how uh, people need to do it. All right. You got the belt. All right. He lost his belt. He got the belt back. It's strap season. It's strap season. It's strap season. Goes Rosario, knocks him out, get two belts. Now it's for Castano. Can he do it? I don't know. But that's how it's supposed to be done. Earl Spence, Terrence Crawford, Deontay Wild, all y'all out here that been bullshitting around. This is how you freaking do it. All right. Jamel Charlo lost. Then he showed that he can come back and win and got his title back. And his. Every match after that, that he won the title back, is going to be a title match. That leads to undisputed. So that's one last match that will lead to undisputed. That happens in July. That's the best thing that ever happened to Jamel Charlo is that he lost to Tony Harrison. I personally thought he won that match, personally. I may be wrong. I might saw something different, but I thought that he won and Jamal lost to Jer Derrick Janko. But uh, besides that, besides that, I like to give all props to Jamel Charlo for being the lion only and not bullshitting, you know what I'm saying, and getting over the mystique of having that O and building a legacy, all right? And that's what he's doing in the 154 weight division. Junior middleweight or whatever they want to call it, super world, whatever they want to call it, um, it's gonna be undisputed. Jamel Charlo or Brian Castano, either or. All right, so I'd like to thank Jamel Charlo for stepping up to the plate, for doing uh what he what he's supposed to do. You have the template of how it's supposed to go down to get to undisputed. All right, you fight champions just like eddie hearn said you fight champions champions fight champions all right charlo tasted defeat they ain't want to taste again and he just gonna collect them belts he gonna collect in his strap season and he's telling the whole damn truth all right man y'all take it easy man this is sweet science sports with dojo the sweetest sports channel in the mall 
This is your man's BJ Aloysius, man. Y'all check me out on my social media links. Y'all know where they at, man. I got to say that video, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, subscribe, comment, share, man. Help the channel grow, man. Y'all do one last thing for me. And y'all just keep banging, man. Peace. Until next time, folks.